Hi everyone, my name is Vineet. So let's write Java program to remove vowels from string expression. So it's very simple program guys and uh, we have multiple approaches to solve this problem. And one of them is using a regex approach. So let's get started with the program using regex approach first. So private static string and method name will be remove. So let's give version here so that we can uh, write the another version of same method so uh, parameter will be string expression so, <coughs> uh, sorry so uh, to write regex we will be using uh, replace all method of string class uh, which is expecting you can see uh, two parameter of string type so first parameter is regex so let's write regex here a e i o u and capital a e i o u and we'll be replacing that with empty string so uh, whatever this replace all method will be return will be return so we'll be returning the same to call method now this one is the first approach and let's write another approach private so instead of this we can copy this method and just change the method name v1 to v2 and input and return type will remain same so first uh, step of this second version will be we will be converting this uh, string expression into string builder string builder I'll explain you uh, why we are using string builder here string builder and expression so uh, we have now in second step we have to create a list of uh, vowels which is a type of character and we will be creating using uh, a double r a y arrays dot as list now let's pass character here so this is for a uh, small case now let's write for uh, capital case so it should be a e sorry it should be i o u now we will be iterating each character of the string builder class so let's do that for int index should start from 0 and uh, index should always less than the length of a uh, string builder and in each iteration index uh, should increment by one so uh, now we have here uh, main condition which will check whether uh, this this uh, vowel is con this current character is verbal or not if it is verbal we will be, we will be removing that from string builder so let's uh, let's write that condition so we are saying vowel if you are containing uh, this sb dot caret index so we are saying uh, to uh, this list list of vowels that vowels uh, if you if you are containing this current character then you have to uh, remove then you have to delete uh, character at this index so you can see here we have delete character at uh, particular index so this delete character at index method is not in string expression string class and we have another uh, method as well. C 
see we have delete if you want to delete from uh, if you want to delete a character from specified index so you can pass start index and end index so it will delete a uh, group of characters from uh, the specified input so uh, we are not using this delete method we are using delete at particular index so this functionality is not there in uh, string class that's why we are using uh, string builder we are not worrying about complexity here so we have done if any of character is uh, if any uh, vowel is there in this uh, string expression and we are converting that in string builder so string builder is containing any uh, vowels so this condition will true and we will be deleting that current character and the remaining uh, characters we have we will be having only constants so we will be returning that uh, to caller method so let's convert string builder into uh, string and return to caller method so we have done this the second version as well so let's write main method <coughs> uh, let's call remove v1 and we'll be passing here uh, hello java world the same will be passing for uh, version 2 as well so here let's call v2 method remove v v2 so now we have uh, same same input for um, both of the logic let's open console and uh, let's run this method yeah so both input is same uh, sorry both input are same and uh, the logic is different so you can see here we have e and o uh, in hello uh, these both are uh, vowels so it's removed and only uh, constant is constant is there and for java we have a is a vowel so a is removed and jv is there so in world we have o is vowels it's removed and remaining characters are there which are uh, constants so uh, you can see here we are writing uh, this list with uh, small and uh, capital cases so we can reduce this extra work here so when we are converting this expression into string builder so this expression might contain character lower case and uh, uh, capital case so we can convert this uh, expression which, which is uh, capital case so this two lower case will be converting that uh, capital case into lower case now string builder is containing only lower case uh, and he can compare that with lower case only so this extra work is reduced and uh, we will be comparing with only lower case characters so let's run this again so you can see here output is again same so it's working fine and uh, this both logic is working fine guys and if you want to uh, remove this capital here so you can uh, convert this expression into lower case and the capital uh, case rejects you can remove here it depend upon you and uh, your use case and uh, we have done with this video guys stay tuned for another videos and i hope this video will be useful for you thank you so much and stay healthy